Well, from sweet waffles to the spiciness of a, a classic Caribbean dish, that's what we're cooking here in the Your Morning Kitchen. And here to share some of her tricks to a flavor-filled stew chicken, stew chicken, not chicken stew, is food expert Camille Moore. Camille, so good to be able to cook with you because I so follow great. you on Instagram, County Cooks. <laughs> that's right. And I always wish you'd invite me for dinner. So now <laughs> this is happening and this is a good thing. I'm finally cooking for you. Okay, stew chicken, not chicken stew. Yes, it's one of those things, I don't know why it's said that way, but that's just the way it's done, so everybody goes with it. Okay. Yeah. It's always stewed chicken. It's actually one of the most popular dishes in Caribbean cooking. Mm -hmm. Every household has their own sort of flavoring and way of making it. And it's also really popular for takeout. It's one of those things that you kind of get your lunch about 10 a.m. because they're going to sell it by noon. Really? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so kind of like the oxtail and all of totally, that. It's right up there. Totally. It's all about flavor. Caribbean food is all about flavor. And the worst thing you could do is have people over and under season. Right. They will call you out oh, if your you food will be is called not out. seasoned properly. That will be your reputation. My, I learned this from my West Indian friends who always travel with a bottle of hot sauce with yeah, them. Just yeah. in case, you know, the it's regular of. Canadian cooking doesn't have enough flavor. Exactly, exactly. All right, so show us how this is done. Yes, yeah, so the main, two main things about making stew chicken is marinating. And you always want to make sure that your chicken is marinated overnight. Again, no flavor is an awful thing. But the second tip is actually making a brown sugar caramel. Ooh. And that sounds a little interesting, like chicken with caramel, but yeah. But the sweet and the savory together would the be sweet, so good. The sweet, the savory, it kind of mellows out all the spices, so we're going to get a little brown sugar in there. Now, is this part of the uh, Caribbean prep of this dish, or is this just a canning special? No, this is actually traditional. This okay, is how it. it's done. Because the whole thing is you want to get a little um, sugar to go in there, and the sweetness will balance out the um, flavor of all of the spices. And so you kind of let that build. And obviously, we're just doing this for TV, so yep. I'm not going to do it for as long as I I would. But once this is all blended. It's all blended. It's going to be bubbling away. Mm -hmm. Awesome. I love having help here. Good. And then you're going to take the chicken pieces and you're leaving the marinade itself actually in the bowl. Okay. So you're taking the chicken pieces and if it was hotter, we would get more of a sizzle. Like a sizzle. But you're trying to get color on the chicken. Maybe let's see if I can just crank that up over all here. All right, let's see if that works. We'll put that on high. And so you're going to get all the pieces in. You leave the marinade bits in the bottom of the bowl. You see I have onion, carrot, there's thyme, there is garlic, ginger, um, allspice, so many awesome things, cayenne pepper, because a little heat is always a good thing. Okay. So you get your chicken all brown, so I love how you're moving that all around. Oh, I got it. I'm here for you, Cammy. I love this. Just hoping you'll invite me for dinner <laughs> still. Pimento peppers, and then the chicken would be all browned, yep. and then you're gonna take all of these awesome marinade ingredients, and you're gonna add them into the bowl as well. And then how long are we gonna let this sit? 45 minutes, you're gonna add this, you're Ooh, gonna add chicken so stock, good. a little bit of soy, like that. And we've got these recipes on our Your Morning it's website. It's all on the website. You okay. would put your chicken stock, do that. And then cover? Cover with some soy sauce. I'm going to get it. to our second dish, Cammie. Let's do so that. This is the stew chicken, and we're yes. going to let it stew. Yes. Uh, now, this is a really classic dish. Oh, yeah. Some people call it rice and peas. Some people call it peas and rice. Yes. In Trinidad, we say rice and peas. And yes, it's traditionally made with white rice, but I'm using brown rice because it's just a little bit more nutritious. OK. And it's not peas in the traditional sense. There's certainly no green peas. It's, we actually use beans, um, so kidney beans. So the first thing you want to do is just to add a little oil, mm -hmm. and you add your rice. Raw rice, not cooked. N yeah, not cooked. And so this first step is just a little toasting. Yep. Ooh, just, nice. You know, get a little nice nuttiness. Here we go. We have a little bit of that sizzle. Fantastic. And then we're going to add everything else into the pan. So we have pimento pepper. Yum. And this pepper is the key to a lot of the Caribbean flavor that we all know and love. Not it's chopped, just whole. Whole. Okay. Yeah, you just put everything in whole because you just want the flavors to come out. So some fresh thyme, and you always just throw the whole stems in there. Okay. Green onion, just break it up. Drop it in. I love it. Some salt. Who needs a knife? Let's just. Who move needs this over a here. knife? All right. Can you add a block of that? Actually, coconut what is this? cream. So that is coconut cream. It comes in block form, and uh, it just oh, yeah. adds. You hear that? There we go. And it will just melt into the rice and give this awesome Ooh. creamy flavor, healthy fats. While you do that, I'm going to try a bit of this. <laughs> Please do. And a reminder: we have all these recipes on our website. Yes. And so well, then you would cover this. Yeah, right? It adds mm -hmm. a little bit of creaminess, mellows out the spices. And this is the base for, you know, your stewed chicken, for your oxtail, for curries. All right. I love it. Thank you so much. This is a great <laughs> lesson. Welcome. Come back anytime. Uh, again, a reminder, the recipes are on yourmorning.ca. We're going to finish this and be back in two minutes. Stew chicken, peas and Stew rice. Stew chicken. Rice and peas. Rice and peas.